Bernard, don't look now, but there seems to be a balloon over your head. <laughs> <laughs> On our lovely cycle ride to lunch the other day, we came down this little route here, which is part of the Bois Verte route, and we came across this campsite on our way. And we had a quick wrecking, we thought, oh, that looks nice. And it actually looked like it was a little bit more spacious and a little bit better laid out than the campsite we were at at the minute. So we did a bit of a swap. <laughs> and this one is um, Camping Maisonneuve. Camping. Maisonneuve, Camping de Charme, lovely. And this is actually a really big campsite. There is lots of pitches and basically this is the reception area just here. So you drive down this big long driveway, pop yourself to reception, which is just here. That's reception. Very, very friendly in reception, no problem at all, speak perfect English. Book yourself in and then you come in, pick a pitch. Oh air balloons you come in and pick a pitch and like I said it's a very very big sprawling campsite there is lots of different types of pictures to choose from so there are pictures that are very well separated under trees pictures at the back over there are next to a little river and there is this very very big um, open um, field area here this is the uh, field that we're in and you kind of camp around the edges and they are still numbered pitches there's a couple of quite a few cemetery blocks so this is the washing up areas and they have another big sanitary block over by the reception area let's just go over this way this one's not usually as busy this is the main bar reception area and um, they do a really nice menu full season and then a reduced menu um, off season and uh, it's very popular. Blues. Obviously you've got your patank court in season, this really big bar pool terrace area is open. It, it really is a very, very nice um, campsite. The facilities are great actually. And what I'll do is I'll just come over here and quickly give you a recce of the pool area, which is also awesome. And it is heated. And if you come here, I'll give you a little recce of the pool. It's covered over at the moment because it's first thing in the morning. But it's like an infinity pool and it flows over the edge. It's a big pool, you can swim in it. It's got lovely terraces, terrace areas around the edges. And then you've got lots and lots of sunbeds and little chairs and tables out. So it really is a very nicely set up um, pool space. It's barriered car parking so you do need a code. They give you that reception when you book in. Do, do, do. And this is the big huge field that we're in. <laughs> There's an Elson disposal just there. They also have the obligatory washers, dryers, paid, and uh, hand washing sinks. Sword. Right, let's get back to the van because we are actually leaving today, and this is the first opportunity I've really had to do a little bit of filming. It's been so busy, but we've really enjoyed it here. We've had two nights here, and um, it has been very, 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 very hot. 
and that's one of the reasons why we're actually heading back north because it's still supposed to be hot down here for another four or five days oh look there's the balloon taking off out of the field next door the field next door uses a balloon for is used for balloon trips we think and they kind of land and take off from there huh? that's awesome let me go and run into the field and see if i can get a picture very quickly Oh, look at that shot, near the cliffs. Beautiful, give them a wave. <laughs> or is he going up? I think he might, oh, he's going to hit the tree. Oh, oh. oh, go, 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 get up over the tree. <laughs> It's so fun. Oh, he's gonna make it, he's gonna make it. Yay, look at that, he's gonna to touch the top. Oh. <laughs> We've actually looked online um, at these balloon rides. They are exceedingly popular in the Dordogne Valley here. It's quite famous for it in this area. And um, they cost around about 200 euros a person. Which I suppose is not that bad. I think he might be coming down in our field next door. Let's go find out. He is coming down in our field. <laughs> balloon <laughs> that is so awesome <laughs> that's a bit of a treat on a Saturday morning isn't it uh, and after getting totally distracted by the uh, balloons landing everywhere, <laughs> this is us on our pitch. <laughs> this is a nice big pitch actually, so it's from here all the way over to this tree here. Nice and big. Grassy, which is nice, not dirt. And uh, this campsite has been costing us 19 euros a night with Axie. So that's with um, electricity, all the swimming facilities and um, easy access to all the gorgeous places in the area uh, and balloons in your back garden. <laughs> cool. <laughs>